TGR. Hey guys, uh, this is Rudy from the Gaming Resume. I am here with your boy Onyx in Orlando, Florida. Yes. We, I can't keep saying that, that you're in Poland and I'm in Orlando. It always feels fun <laughs> saying that. I don't know. It, it, it is definitely um, an interesting thing. I, I swear, like, thanks technology for letting us do yeah. this. Um, <laughs> for doing this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. So um, we earlier in the day, we found out that Nintendo went ahead and announced the Switch Lite. So um, we're going to go ahead and watch the trailer and uh, react to it. Right. And afterwards, we're going to go ahead and talk a little bit about our thoughts. So okay. without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. Let's do it. Konnichiwa. What's up, Koizumi? You're welcome, Mr. Koizumi. It's been my pleasure to play your games. <laughs> That's exactly how we all look when we play the Switch. Literally, just like that. Yep. <laughs> I go camping with my Switch, too. Yeah, I go to school with my Switch. Actually, I can't lie. I did go to school when I was when I was still getting my degree. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah yeah my teacher was like dude what do, you, do we have horses in the classroom because i was playing breath of the wild Ooh. yo all right that looks smaller than the yeah no it, it is it is i um i looked it up i mean the, the information has been out all day so it was kind of hard to avoid but uh. um yeah i haven't seen this at all this looks really cool so i know it's smaller I think the screen is also smaller too. Is it still 720? I don't know. Probably. Good day. There's a lot of stuff that came out, but. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> always. Of course. <laughs> God Sorry. bless you. <laughs> You dying over there in Florida? The pollen counts high? Pretty sure, yeah. Alright, so... Oh, man. Oh, here we go. Let's... If it's smaller, it's like barely smaller. Just off of like looking at that. I think what I read was like 30% smaller or something along those lines. So if it's a smaller screen, then it's probably got better battery life. Yeah, that's my assumption. That's my assumption. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> Zelda. If it, man, that Switch Pro better come with Breath of the Wild too. Just it needs saying. to, for Just sure. Saying. It needs to. For those of you watching, we were talking earlier about it, about the potential of a Switch Pro, and uh, higher specs, um, probably a little bit more powerful, and. Uh, definitely coming around or at the same time as breath of the wild 2 yeah it needs to do that yeah for sure there we go camping boom <laughs> we need to go camping and have our switch dude i'm gonna take it to the mountains with me tomorrow are you taking it to space though no i'm not that cool <laughs> my man we got nasa up in here <laughs> <laughs> spacex bro Oh my god, my allergies are killing me right now. Sorry for the people looking at my face. <laughs> oh, man. It is all good. Yeah, that's how I play Switch. <clears throat> yeah, there you go. This makes more sense. <laughs> Much in a more bed, sense. In a house. Yep. Hey, I haven't played that game yet. Dude, I can't wait to play that game. Heck yeah. I'm, I'm digging Dude, the form factor. The, the D-pad... Yeah, mm. big deal. Mm. Big deal for sure. Mm. It looked sexy. <笑><笑>ニンテンドースイッチライトがなかまりすることでさらにいろんな場所に持っていってプレイできそうですね。ニンテンドースイッチライトはニンテンドースイッチとは違った特徴があります。ではご紹介していきましょう。<笑> No TV, baby. 
I still don't get that, man. <laughs> yeah. It's definitely, definitely an interesting decision. He walked out. He's outside. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So no Joy Cons. <clears throat> yeah. Pretty much allows for a smaller form factor. That is so cool, man. I still dig that. Yeah, the, the yeah. Oh, dude, the height's different too. So. Yep. No HD rumble either. <laughs> They're still pushing one two switch. <laughs> of course, dude. <laughs> Okay. Are there any games that don't support handheld mode? I can't mode? think of them any. Bro, you sound like you need some Benadryl. I do. My allergies are eating me alive. I'd be then like pet a cat or something like that before you started. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, there we go. Get some more details. It's it's a good console to get for the kid. Like 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 my son, I think would enjoy getting this just because. He, oh, 920, okay, yeah, September. Yeah. So, like, my son likes to use the Switch handheld, so. I mean, I'm not going to lie, I use handheld a lot. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's definitely something that I would get for my son. That is pretty much how I'm feeling about it right now. Because, um, like, I just, I don't, I don't see myself getting that. Um, and it, it's like I said, the whole, um, I, I just, I don't know, man, like the, the, the actual PCB, the, the part that goes ahead and, and um, in the switch dock that up everything is so small. I mean, there's, right. pl there's plenty of videos online that talk about it and there's plenty of like articles that talk about it. It's so small that that should have been at least like an additional add-on if you're like yeah the switch light is there if you want to go ahead and use it on the tv here you go you can buy it you know and i'm pretty sure somebody's gonna go ahead and try to do it anyways and see what happens but yeah there's gonna be third party stuff i i wouldn't be surprised if it was a third party like cable that will connect the switch light to the tv i mean or something. We'll, we'll see because like the thing is that the the thing with third party right now is that all of the third party there there's no like third party dock that that's actually going to work you actually have to go ahead and take the pcb inside of the switch dock and put that into like a a, a smaller housing and that's how people have been you know being able to like you know get a smaller dock so to speak i think but i thought i thought there was a third party dock out there that was small the, it, it is I I yeah yeah the, it's, oh, okay, it's, out, okay. it's out there but the you still need to get the pcb out of the switch dock if not oh. like you have you run such a high risk of breaking your switch that it's oh. not even worth it oh damn yeah so and and wolf then he like kind of like goes into it and everything like that but long story short the usb-c standards that were pretty much set up by like google and you the us <clears throat> the universal serial bus company and all this and that like yeah they went ahead and they were like all right you know these are the standards for like the wattage and all this and that and blah blah blah, blah. and nintendo goes ahead and pulls a nintendo and gets like this weird <laughs> you know 2.3 watt or whatever i don't even know the exact numbers of it but i mean yeah i'm sure we can link to a video that talks about it and that it's just so off the wall that nobody uses this it's not it's not like um anything that's patented or anything like that it's just it's so off the wall and so off like deep end that nobody uses it so because of that it just it becomes uh essentially like a huge mess to for third party companies to go ahead and you know provide 
third party solutions to that so i don't know man <clears throat> that to me is like the biggest thing because it's like it's the same processor it's the same cpu it, it's essentially the same thing just in a smaller form factor yeah provide a smaller dock simple as that right i mean that that kind of takes away from the whole switch right the name yeah, I get that they want to try focusing on right. Yeah, you can't really switch anything. Yeah. Um, I get that they're trying to focus on handheld and make it a lot more cheaper. I mean, two hundred bucks is pretty cheap. Oh um, yeah. And from what I read online was that this actually might have a, a newer CPU, a new Tegra chip, right? Correct. Kind Correct. of a big deal. This is actually might be more powerful than the regular Switch. Yep. And coincidentally, we I just said you before we started recording this video. The, there was a new FCC filing that Nintendo was going to have the same Switch with that same new CPU and battery. Yep. Like, so we're get, literally going to get a new... <laughs> the, the Switch is going to become the Pro. <laughs> <laughs> pretty much. I mean, it's just... It's insane because it allows for... I mean, pretty much... It's kind of like the... the What was it? Oh, my God. The, the new 3DS? Is that what they called it? Right. The new 3DS. Yep. So that's essentially what that's going to be, and I mean, there were rumors before that they were going to go ahead and do like some form of refresh that would allow a little bit more power to it. People are saying that it's going to be anywhere between 1.5 times more power to like 2 times more power. I'm leaning yeah, more yeah, towards yeah. like the 1.5 just because you, you, you can't create that much of a disparity between the two, I guess would be the best way of right. saying it. Um, right. So I don't know, um, and obviously it's probably going to be from Nvidia. It's probably going to be some form of like overclocked um, Tegra chip or a new version of the Tegra chip. I mean, I don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. The... I'm sure it's going to be something like that. But I, I, I think this is a good addition to the family. When the 2DS came out, people were saying the same thing. They got rid of the 3DS, or I'm sorry, they got rid of the 3D. They got rid. I think they got rid of the gyro that it had. I forget what the 3DS had, but they got rid of a bunch of stuff that that. that console came with and then they were like all right here's a 2ds it's way cheaper uh here you go you know yeah. uh i think it even had sometimes they had better screens i forget exactly how it was at the time the 2ds came out but i remember people were still kind of upset that they got rid of the 3d it's like well, yeah you, yeah you're naming it the 2ds uh but this is essentially a, a better ds and that's that was okay i think it was fine a lot of people a lot of kids bought it i know a lot of people that bought the 2ds for their children and i can see this happening with the switch too yeah, I mean, honestly, you know, it, 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 I feel like it's meant for kids or it's meant yeah. for even if, if you're like, you know, a teenager or an adult, it, it's it's for the casual gamer. I feel like that you can yeah, go I ahead mean, and go yeah. handheld. I mean, I don't know. This isn't this isn't for somebody that wants to connect to their 4K TV. It never was supposed to be for their for that person. This is it's a handheld console. Yeah. This can't connect to your TV, at least for now, you know, so there's no point in even like thinking about it. this is literally for somebody that wants to take this on the go that's yep. really what it is maybe so. i should buy it now you're, you're selling <laughs> it, you're selling it to me now and i'm just like man maybe maybe i should go ahead and just you know take it on the go i'm uh, not gonna lie to you i'm not gonna lie to you if i if, if they make a really good looking uh switch light like that pokemon one that they showed um if they can do that like a special edition for like a game that i really really want like i don't know panzer dragoon i might kind of have to buy it well dude <laughs> it's it's a unibody design it makes it so much easier to Correct. go ahead and and do that like yeah you you can go ahead and do that with pretty much anything and collector's edition switches i mean it's why gonna not? be a thing it's yeah it's gonna be a thing for sure for sure oh yeah totally totally no this is cool man uh it's definitely exciting i, I feel like since there's a smaller screen and uh it's probably a, a better optimized cpu you might probably get a couple more minutes maybe hours of uh battery life obviously yeah, 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 yeah. obviously <laughs> it's dependent on the game uh, you know you can play you know uh, celeste for hours and it won't drain your battery right you play right breath of the wild like you'll get two and a half three like two hours. and a half yeah 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 it wasn't a lot yeah. yeah easy easy so it really depends on you know what is going on and what the cpu is actually doing itself so um yeah. i don't know man um I, i'm kind of hyped because that shows that the company is going forward with the evolution of the switch and it, it's a heck of a good platform and console so we'll, we'll see what happens yeah exactly exactly nintendo knows what they're doing and bowser even went out and said that he uh you know there's not going to be a pro coming out during this christmas this christmas 
What about exactly. next Christmas? Exactly. When Breath of the Wild 2 is expected to come out. Boom, Trust man. me, it's happening. It's happening. You, you said it, man. I, I, I sincerely <laughs> believe that it's going to happen next year. And uh, yeah. we'll, we'll see what happens. I mean, um, I don't know. I hope that at TGS they'll show a little bit more. Um, and then the next real big thing is E3, I feel like. At least for Nintendo. Well, the Game Awards. The game They, they like to show up to the Game Awards for games. Yeah. We saw Breath of the Wild's first gameplay footage at the Game Awards. True. So true. they do like to show up there. And... I mean, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But I think I think the next time we'll see some major, major uh, content for Nintendo will be uh, Game Awards because they show up at TGS, but it's not like they don't show too much crazy stuff there. So yeah. All right. Well, I mean, we'll, we'll see what happens. I guess we'll wait yeah. for the for the VAs. All right. Perfect. All right, man. Well, this was fun as always. <laughs> over in poland here in orlando <laughs> six hour time difference whatever no biggie no biggie we'll, we'll figure it out we'll figure it out but what uh, do you guys think though uh did you guys like the switch reveal a switch light are you gonna buy one do you hate it with all your heart and passion i know some people do <laughs> oh yeah definitely there, there are some people that were salty with it but whatever man i, I feel yeah. like it's it's just diversification and it's a different exactly. they're trying to hit a different market so i don't know man but uh let us know what you think in the comments um if you haven't had a chance uh go check out our patreon and see the different tiers that are there um and aside from that uh subscribe to the channel that's that's probably the best way to support us Please. subscribe Please. to the channel hit the little bell that way you get notifications every single time that we post a new video and um yes until next time guys deuces see you later like what you saw? Check out some of our other videos. Be sure to click the subscribe button, hit the little bell, and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for your support, and thanks for watching.